Hi there, my name's Ben Banyard. Uh, I'm a poet who lives in Portishead, just outside Bristol, uh, on the Severn Estuary. Um, I'm so happy to be uh, in this excellent anthology. Um, so, you know, thanks so much to Michael, Steve and Kaylee for including my poem in there. Um, and also to Dave for organising these readings. It's a great opportunity to, to share our work. I'm sorry I'm not able to uh, read it live to you, um, but uh, hopefully this is the next best thing. Um, my poem, uh, Scottish Tenor, uh, came about just like a lot of my poems, something completely innocuous, um, looking in my wallet and finding that I had uh, um, a Scottish £10 note in there. Um, and in England, it, you kind of get that trepidation about having that. You shouldn't have to because it's legal tender. Um, but then I saw the call for uh, poems for this anthology and thought that it was a perfect um, analogy and it's not the Brexit thing. I thought they're going to be bombarded by Brexit poems um, and so I just thought uh, I'd send them this one and very happily they accepted it. Um, so without further ado, uh, I'll read Scottish Tenor. It's strange to have cash these days. The notes crackle in my wallet, poke above receipts and loyalty cards. One of them is a Clydesdale tenor. Legal tender south of the border, never you mind. But I see doubt flicker across the assistant's face. She eyes Robbie Burns with suspicion, flips it over to the view of Edinburgh as though looking for instructions. I dare her. Is there a problem? She glances back at me, shakes her head, presses a few buttons on the till and gets my change. I see my note has a little compartment all to itself. Have a nice day, she smiles. Thanks for listening.